All right, it's September 2024. We are looking at Fairview Plantation. Only the Fairview side, not the Foxland side, because I like it better. And that's the area that I typically work in. What we're seeing on the market, we are seeing more homes for sale than we have seen over the rest of the year. Uh, I think there's 16 currently on the market. Typically, we see 8 to 12 at most. Um, sometimes that even dips down to like 5 or 6. But right now, there's 16 homes on the market. What does that mean for you? It means... If you're going to sell your home, it might take a little bit longer because there are more homes to be absorbed and buyers have options. They have that opportunity to go look around, check out all their options. It slows down that decision-making cycle and it can take folks longer to make a decision. It may just, we've seen it across our market everywhere in Middle Tennessee and including Fairview Plantation. So what we saw in the last month, we saw three homes go under contract. We saw seven close out. I'm going to go through some of these ones that closed to help you get an idea of value for your property in Fairview Plantation. We saw two of the townhomes up on Glen Minister close, but one at 486, one at 485. Basically the same price. Um, these are both in good shape, almost identical units. We'll see a typical premium. Look at the white appliances there. Okay, I hear you. I see you. Uh, that looks pretty good. Um, the best pictures in the world, but it's sold and it's sold for 45. I feel pretty confident if you have one of the two bedroom, three bath that's right around 2,000 to 2,100 square feet. 485 is probably that number. That's realistic. Um, if you have a corner ones, typically see a little bit of a premium for the ones on the corner. In the front section of the neighborhood up near the playground, this one over on Lafitte went for just under 800, sold in a day, 3,300 square feet. These typically go really quickly if they're priced right. Under 800 is kind of that number right now. And that one was 3,300 of four bedrooms. So if you have one of those, it's in good shape. It's clean. I think around 800 is that number. Slight premium for bigger, a little bit less if it needs a little bit of work or updating. Big one over on Jacobs. This was just entered as a comp, which means it was t probably sold off market, never actually listed for sale on the MLS. It's a private transaction, big golf course home. 2-4 is a big number for that, so good for them. Um, one up in Gracie Lake at 770. This one was on the market only three and a half weeks, so not that long. Just under 3,000 square feet. 770, that's on the higher range. That's yeah, about average, maybe a little bit lower for Gracie Lake, but when you compare it to something like the Isaac Franklin section of the neighborhood, that's towards the higher end for that price point. Speaking of Isaac Franklin, we saw two transact over there. And one for just under 650, 2,200 square feet. Let's see what that thing looks like on the inside. Clean, updated, looks pretty good. I, I, I take back the updated statement. That's obviously the original kitchen. Got that tile backsplash, which is always interesting. But good clean house, nothing wrong with that. And sold at 650. That one sold in four days, so went pretty quick. Only other sale that closed in the neighborhood. Lakefront for 1.5. Sold in about three weeks, sold for 100 under lists. This is an awesome one. The views from that back porch are probably fantastic. Um, there they are. That's awesome. These all have shared docks. You're getting one boat slip in there. If you live in the neighborhood, you already know that. But for one five for a lake house with interesting choices in terms of the fixtures and everything stacked over there and the color of cabinets. Makes sense that it went at that price. Again, if you want to be on the lake and you want a slip that you can walk to in your backyard, that was a great option for you. So that is what's going on in Fairview Plantation. If you own a home in Fairview and you're thinking about putting it on the market, you want to know a range of what it will sell for, call me, email me. All my contact info is somewhere below this video. If you're ready to put it on the market and you want me to come give you a room by room review, we'll go through the house, talk about if we need to move furniture, if we need to paint, if we need to get carpets cleaned, whatever we need to do to get your home show ready, we can come out. I'll come out in person. I'll personally walk through your home. I sold a bunch of houses in the neighborhood. I feel pretty good. I can tell you exactly what you need to do to make your home as appealing as possible for someone who wants to be in the neighborhood. Thanks for watching this. I hope you're having a great fall. Buckle down. It looks like some weather's coming in with this storm the next couple days, but hopefully this is helpful for you. If you have any questions about Fairview or what's going on in the real estate market there, don't hesitate to reach out.